Hello everyone, Jonathan Schleck, EA Achim Weather here, with a heavy weather update for the day one outlook. We have three Hewlett Rich Gary to tell you about. We have one Hewlett Rich Gary over here, that encompasses parts of South Central Ohio, far southwestern West Virginia, parts of Central and East Central Kentucky, and North Central Tennessee. Going over here, we have another Hewlett Rich that encompasses parts of Central Utah. In the very far extreme north central tip of Arizona. And another slight risk area includes <clears throat> parts of South Central Washington State and parts of Central Oregon. So, and we have multiple marginals. We have five marginal risk areas to tell you about. We have one marginal over here, a broad marginal that covers parts of Arkansas. Most of Mississippi, most of Alabama, northwestern Georgia, far northwestern South Carolina, northwestern North Carolina, pretty much all of Tennessee, most of Kentucky, southeastern Indiana, most of Ohio, all of West Virginia, most of Virginia, Washington, D.C., central and western Maryland, central and western Pennsylvania, and southwestern New York State. We have another marginal over here that covers... Parts of West Central Nebraska, Northwestern Kansas, and Northeastern Colorado. Another marginal up here today covers parts of Northeastern Montana and Far Western North Dakota. We have another marginal over here that covers Far Eastern Nevada, most of Utah, Northwestern Arizona, Far Southwestern Wyoming, and Far Northwestern Colorado. And another marginal is up here that covers <coughs> Parts of Central Washington State, uh, Western Oregon, and North Central California. Going over to the tornado threat now, we have a 2% chance of an isolated tornado today that covers parts of Central, well, actually parts of South Central Ohio, and Central Kentucky. So, that's a tornado threat. Going to the wind threat now, we have three areas where we have a 15% chance of damaging wind gusts. Of 58 miles per hour higher today. One that covers parts of South Central Ohio, far southwestern Kentucky, or excuse me, far southwestern West Virginia, uh, Central Kentucky, and North Central Tennessee. Another area where we have a 15% chance of damaging wind gusts of 58 miles per hour higher today covers parts of Central Utah and the very far extreme. North Central Tip of Arizona. Another area where we have a fifteen percent shaky damage wind a fifteen percent shaky damage wind gusts of fifty eight miles per hour higher today covers parts of South Central Washington State, uh Central Oregon as well. And zooming out we have five areas where we have a five percent shaky damage wind gusts of fifty eight miles per hour higher today. One that covers much of Arkansas, much of Mississippi, much of Alabama, northwestern Georgia, far northwestern South Carolina, northwestern North Carolina, uh, pretty much all of Tennessee, most of Kentucky, southeastern Indiana, most of Ohio, all of West Virginia, most of Virginia, Washington, D.C., central and western Maryland, central and western Pennsylvania, in southwestern New York State. Another area where we have a 5% chance of damaging wind gusts of 58 miles per hour higher today covers parts of West Central Nebraska, Northwestern Kansas, and Northeastern Colorado. Another 5% wind risk area covers Northeastern Montana and West Central North Dakota. We have another 5% risk of damaging wind gusts of 58 miles per 58 miles per hour higher today that covers eastern Nevada, most of Utah, southwestern Wyoming, northwestern Colorado, and northwestern Arizona. Another 5% wind risk area, don't like this update on me, but another 5% wind risk area covers parts of south central Washington State, western, western Oregon, and north central California. Going to the hail threat now, we have two areas where we have a 5% chance for hail of 1 inch in diameter or larger today. One that covers South Central Ohio, 
far southwestern West Virginia, central Kentucky, and north central Tennessee. Going up here now, we have a 15% chance of hail of one inch in diameter or larger today. That covers parts of south central Washington State and west central Oregon. So, <clears throat> and we have a 5% chance for hail of one inch in diameter or larger today. We have four areas where we have a 5% chance for hail of one inch in diameter or larger today. One that covers much of Arkansas, northern Mississippi, northern Alabama, far northwestern Georgia, most of Tennessee, most of Kentucky, southeastern Alabama, parts of central Ohio, and west central West Virginia. Another area where we have a 5% chance for hail of 1 inch in diameter or larger today covers parts of west central Nebraska, northwestern Kansas, and northeastern Colorado. Another 5% area of hail of 1 inch in diameter or larger today covers northeastern Montana and west central North Dakota. Going over here, we have a 5% chance of hail of 1 inch of one inch in diameter or larger today that covers parts of South Central Washington State, Western Oregon, and North Central California. So, going to the summary now, scattered severe thunderstorms are possible in parts of Kentucky and the Ohio Valley on Saturday afternoon. Isolated severe thunderstorms are also expected across the Utah region and over parts of Western Oregon and the Southwest Washington. Wind and hail are the primary threat, so that's the day one outlook. I am going to have a separate video on the day two outlook, which will come out very soon, so stay tuned for the day two outlook, which will come out very soon.